should look something like that. <sighs> Slotted tungsten thread, 70 denier black. But just a little tiny bump right there. Pardo CDL. And we'll just catch that right there. And I put that little bump there because when you get back to the bump, if you tie right in front of it, it'll push those tail fibers up. Okay, next I've got some blue crystal flash, just one strand here. Spin my thread counterclockwise just to flatten it out. Build just a tiny, tiny taper. Flatten my thread out again. Bring that to the front. Give that just a quick half hitch just so that when taken and hang my thread away. Just leaving a tiny little gap. UV clear in the floor seam. Don't want to get it on your CDL. Just kind of spin it and cure it with our UV light. Okay, so next I've got some light done, CDC, and we've got black. There's the two CDC feathers. So I just put the two CDC feathers together on top of each other, just line up the stems, bring the fibers down, CDC clip, and I want it real, just real short. Okay, so next I'm going to take my fine point scissors. that much. So next we're gonna spin our thread counterclockwise. We're gonna take our bodkin and we're just gonna split the thread. Take our little CDC clip. We're just gonna insert that as close to the head as possible. And then we're going to pull and release that as we put tension. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to spin the bobbin with the thread and that will cord up the, the CDC. So I'm going to hold one finger right here. So now as I said I'm just going to cord the thread back up. Just let it spin, 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 spin. And when it gets, when it starts to slow down, come down here by the tip and grab it and then push it up. That's quite a bit of CDC for this fly, so I am gonna come in here and just kind of just trim some up. I just want real short fibers because CDC traps quite a bit of air bubbles. And we're gonna go ahead and wrap this. And I think that's good. We'll pull those extra fibers out of there. Give that a couple wraps. And next, we've got some ice blue dubbing, which is really gonna make this fly pop. And you wanna grab like a, a decent chunk, lay it over the top like that, and then we're going to just, just secure it. We're gonna pull it back. Should look something like that. Haha, <laughs> it 
contest kitten. Okay, for real, I'm gonna grab just a real small pinch of it. And we're just gonna just spin a nice little dubbing collar or a dubbing rope. Pretty generous one. And I like to leave the fibers long. You'll see why here in a second. That's way too much, but it's okay. It's gonna look. And we'll just pull the excess off. Let me trim it up here and I'll show you guys what it looks like. Trim this real lightly. Brush out some of these fibers. And here's the fly trimmed up. Let's take a look at it underwater. I'll show you guys what it looks like. Watch how the CDC captures air bubbles. The little bubble air just popped. Let me know what you guys think it represents best in the comments. I'd eat it. Wait, one more thing, one more thing. Can you guys do me a favor and please hit the subscribe button? It just it helped me out a lot. As something like 70% of my viewers are not subscribed, <laughs> which, which is crazy, but that's how it goes. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys in the next episode. Steve from Blackfly signing.